Hi guys, Through here from Prepare Camping and today I'm looking at another gas mask. Now you can see here it says M59 but this is actually the M1. This is a Yugoslavian gas mask, also referred to as a Serbian gas mask but everywhere that was in the former Yugoslavia used these when Yugoslavia broke up so the Croats had them as well and many other countries had them afterwards when they were sold on the surplus market. So again, same as my um, finished one my M61, same as that, it's a 60 mil filter that fits on there. So that's the inside of that. No rattly noises, so hopefully it still works. And that just screws in here. Now obviously I don't know what was in this former Eastern European block um, filter so it could have asbestos, could have all sorts, I don't know but the handy thing with it being a 60mm is that I can just take that out of the way pop that back on I can take that out of the way I can take the 60mm from my finish M61 and that will also fit on there There. So now that will work instead. And of course, these things are getting harder and harder to get hold of. So what you can do, if you don't want to use that at all, is you can use a 40mm one, like this uh, British Army surplus one I have, if you just use one of these adapter plates. You can get these off Amazon, eBay, and it's quite cool. Basically you screw the 60mm into your gas mask, and that gives you a 40mm socket for your filters to fit onto. Just goes in there. So, as it's a copy of the M1, same as what the M61 finished gas mask is, it fits pretty similar as well. Simply pull these to tighten it. And then that extra on there, Around the back of the neck and click onto there. So it provides a very good seal all the way around. And with this uh, British S10 canister on it, I feel pretty secure and pretty good. So yeah, like I said, I wouldn't trust the original fillers that come with them, but swapping out for a modern one, you're good to go. There's a slight difference to the rubber. You can see here the inside of the mask. It's got this sort of textured feel. You can just see those little dimples there. Sort of a textured feel. Um, but there's only the gasket around where your mouth and nose is. So I'll show you the inside. Of the finished one you got that inner gasket and then there's a, another one out here to make a, a better seal around your face although when i've put this on this this does quite a good job of making an effective seal as well as long as you tiny up sufficiently uh the straps though aren't as comfortable as they are on the uh the finish m61 either so if i was if i was to choose my favorite between the two it'd be the m61 uh even though this does come in green, and as we all know, everything is better when it's in green. So anyhow, that's the, M6, uh, that's the M1 Yugoslavian or Croatian gas mask. It's a good one to have in the collection. I got this one from eBay. I think it was only 12 or £13. Pounds. So they're very, very cheap. And like I say, spend another £2 pounds getting one of them and get some modern filters. And you've got an excellent gas mask for just a few pounds. Definitely worth doing. So if you enjoyed this video guys, please consider watching this one. And if you really liked it, maybe subscribe here. Thanks very much.